Alright, so job blog. Um, as you may or may not know, I'm currently an apprentice electrician in San Diego. And a couple different ideas are going through my mind of what I can do. One of those ideas is I want to basically create a, a blog about being a construction worker because of all the people I'm meeting, the stories I'm hearing, uh, what I'm noticing and seeing going on in the construction industry, you know, and how I, I think it'd just be interesting and fascinating to document this. Uh, I just need to find the time to uh, research and see what you know, people are doing that. I, uh, a challenge for that is, Time. I have the time, but I'm uh, just a little distracted with my other interests, as well as yeah, it's just a you know just going to class at the same time and the stress of what I need to do, what I need to accomplish. It's not putting me in the right frame of mind to be introspective and analyze and, and reflect on what I'm encountering, what's going on. Um, so that's just kind of detracting from my uh, desire to pursue that, uh, you know, that research. And I, I, I know I just need to do it. Uh, other things going on in my personal life which are just distracting and taking up my time. So sooner or later I'll get around to uh, following up on it. And something else I've been thinking of job-wise, job blog-wise, is I'm thinking of creating a blog series where I present myself and uh, the, the concept is that I am interested in exploring and joining the veteran uh, networking job market in the United States starting in San Diego. A lot of veterans in San Diego, a lot of veteran organizations in San Diego, a lot of organizations that help network uh, job business owners and I I see it in myself to be a business owner. I feel that I have this, these skills and understanding and the ability to just soak in as much information and knowledge as I can and be able to use that information and knowledge to benefit the company that I'm a part of. I. So that's my ultimate goal, is that I want to see myself as a uh, business partner, co-owner of a company. Uh, I, I do have an idea of at least two to three companies, which I can see myself uh, as a part of. And in particular, that's you know, a company I can see myself starting. Uh, and then uh, another idea of a company I can see myself uh, running, like the long-term or ultimate goal, so to speak. The so the the blog would be me detailing uh, what I'm doing, and I would want to showcase. Uh, the people I meet, the organizations and meetings I come across, uh, show to the world, to the greater economic uh, researchers even, you know, this is what the job market is like. These are the people, what is on their mind, what their goals and aspirations are, what their fears are, uh, provide that sort of deep journalistic analysis or editorial analysis, not, not editorial, but um, you know, provide a, 
a documentarian perspective of what I'm encountering, what I'm seeing and hearing, uh, allowing people that I meet to speak in their own words, what they think, what they feel. That would require some editing. <laughs> so, um, and because I know that I, I'll be meeting a lot of interesting people of back, different backgrounds and experiences who just have all sorts of interesting stories and anecdotes that they can share and relate. And I also feel that if I pursued uh, such a job blog that requires a lot more of me uh, to put forth a professional uh, persona and you know, wearing a lot more business suits. And as a result, uh, it's a lot more work I have to do. I'm willing to do the work. Because I, I also feel that doing this, that sort of job blog, would uh, help me in getting me motivated, getting me excited and interested in uh, a job I can get into and, and meeting people, and, uh, discovering new possibilities, you know, giving me a better direction in terms of what I'm doing. And I'm hoping that, yeah, that opens doors and opportunities for me working as well. Which could be the, the interesting side effect to that, because uh, someone does hire me early on, and, and it's not uh, <laughs> it's not in, in terms of uh, me being an owner, but me being a underling. Well, then there goes that blog. I'm not uh, being the active agent. I'm, I'm now you know, part of the organization helping making it better. And that just sort of removes me <laughs> uh, having these you know, greater aspirations for the time being because I have to work and gain the experience and uh, make the networks and networking and connections. So it would be an interesting uh, thing to. Uh, see how it unfolds, but yeah, it's just, it's something, definitely something I would like to pursue and check out. On top of that, because, yeah, I, I do get nervous talking with people, and I worry about how am I putting my best uh, face on when I'm meeting people, how am I putting putting forth the best uh, persona. So, that's something uh, I have to think about. But, yeah, it's, that's something I have to think about to pursue. So, yeah, talk to you guys later.